Hey everyone, welcome back to Plant and Grow. My name is McGuire. Today we're going to do some big box store plant shopping. Uh, we're going to try and find some cool plants, um, maybe some sport monsteras, sport money trees, anything like that. The first one we're going to hit up is Lowe's. As you can see, there's the garden center over there. I heard that they had a new shipment in of some rare exotic plants. So let's go in there, see what we can find, and I'll, uh, I'll bring you along. So I hope you guys enjoy the journey. I think we're gonna go to Lowe's and then maybe Menards and then possibly not even a big box store, but it's another plant store around the area that I live in. And we're gonna go see what they have too because I heard they also got in another new shipment. So let's go check it out guys, come along. So they have this huge hanging pot of golden pothos, which is actually very vibrant. I don't have one like this, but if I could, I would. Here's some variegated ivy. Brought one of these home one time and it had spider mites everywhere. Majestic palms, little babies. I think this is a Bella palm. Oh yeah, it is actually, I like these. Ooh, some ZZs. I always try to look at these, see if there's any sport in here. I had a friend who found a pink one. So jealous. But yeah, I'm just trying to look for any sports at all. I mean, really. It's a fun thing to do. I don't even know what this really is, but I like this. Kind of reminds me of like a string of something, but it's not. Golden Pothos. Nothing really there. They have some snake plants, more ZZ, ponytail palms down here. These are actually cool. I don't mind having one of these. We have a garden center that in my in my town that has one of these and it's huge. It's like seven foot plus. It actually has babies coming off the base of it too, which is awesome. Got a huge selection of fiddle figs, which is pretty cool. They don't have these like a ton around here, so it's kind of cool that they at least have them. Then here's the clearance section. Bamboo, got his path of filing back there. It's just a lot of, I always like bonsais. I had one when I was little, such cool plants. Crotons, fiddle fig. They do have some money trees. I was trying to find some sport ones earlier, but I don't think there's anything in here. No. Have some nice looking aglionema. Ooh, flowering actually even. That's kind of cool. Some more ZZs, Aglionemas, more money trees, some beautiful orchids. I've always wanted one. I had one, but it died. It didn't do very good. Got some Cordyline, some more majestic palms. They do have some Adansonii, some golden pothos, some little, little baby fiddle figs. It'd be cool to find a sport very good one of these. Some more ZZs. Raven ZZs. Looks like they have some begonias. Don't know what kind. Exotic Angel. I don't know if that's the name actually. Yeah, just a lot of stuff, but I don't think I'm finding anything today. We got some rabbit foot ferns. These are always cute. Such a cool plant. Got some nice syngoniums. More crotons. Cute pots, actually. I do like these. Wick and Grow. I've seen this brand coming out a lot more. I like it though. Yeah, guys, I think that's Lowe's. I'll get back to you when I hit up Home Depot, 
Menards or whatever else. So we lucked out at Lowe's, nothing really there. I thought there was gonna be a new shipment in, but nothing new was there, which kind of stinks. I was kind of hoping that we would find something, but uh, we just traveled and we went to Home Depot. As you can see, Garden Center over here, where it usually is open is closed today, but I can still get in. I know all the plants are like right in that area over there. So I'm gonna go in there. I'll let you guys follow and uh, yeah, let's get to it. We're in Home Depot. Looks like they actually do have a new shipment of plants and got a lot of snake plants, aloes, ravens up there, some Dracaena. I actually like these a lot. This is cool. I've actually been wanting a cactus. I might get like two of these and put them in one pot. I think that would look cool. I've always loved these. <laughs> it looks like you could like squeeze them, but you can't. And I think that prices are 15% off on everything. If I'm seeing correctly on something. Oh, this, this would actually be cool too. Ooh, I like the pots on this. How much is this? What does it say? 12, not bad. Oh, I think that's a small barrel cactus. I like that. I might get one of those. I don't know. I have a huge aloe, massive. And I did see some money trees over here. Little selection. I've been trying to find a sport one, but it doesn't look like there's any in here. From what I was looking at, nothing. That's all right, we'll find one someday. I like how intricate these are braided though. It's cool. Lots of succulents, crotons, got a spath, spath phylum. Found a sport variegated one of these a while ago. Oh, look at that. There's some sport on that, actually. It's kind of cool. It'd be cool to get an Albo one. I have an Aria one, but Albo would be cool. Crotons. Little string of pearls. Looks like it's kind of toasted. <laughs> they got a lot of succulents, though. Holy crap. Tritoscanti is up there. But tons of snake plants. Aloes. Dracaenas. Golden Pothos. Looks like maybe some agglionemas over here but yeah pretty much it again um not much but this is kind of cool i wish that this was bigger and i wish it was on more of it but nothing nothing else from what i can see at least always be gentle with the plants when you're here doing this stuff because obviously someone has to buy these things you don't want to ruin them but yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this is really it but Hopefully, leave down in the comments. You want me to do this again? I can go to more places and uh, sport hunt, look for some plants. All right, so we got skunked again at Home Depot, um, unfortunately. But at least we got out there. We got to adventure some new plants, um, see what some big box stores had to deliver for us. Nothing really new, so I didn't really end up with, any, with anything. I was going to buy that prickly pear cactus, but I ended up not doing it because we have a little one. She's going to start crawling. I don't really want her to be touching cactuses, if that makes any sense. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want more content like this where I go out, look for plants, uh, sport hunt for monsteras, really any other plant because sport variegation can happen on any plant. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to do more videos like this. I love videos like this, so I'm guessing other people do too. So yeah, guys. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.